Back again! Yep. More black screen and into the Kukai Foundation. I'm thinking... I was tempted to start singing after you said back again, but <laughs> it's probably best that I don't. I'm as tone deaf as they get, so. <laughs> so here I'm checking to see if I have any other parts for the uh, super ultimate robot of destruction and death that the professor wants, and I don't. Sounds like I don't, so I don't go to the to the, the robot academy. I'm thinking, wait, sh is Alan at the beach? And I'm thinking, no, he's not at the beach. And so, so I'll go to the city sector 26 and 27, and I remember that where exactly he is. So I go in there. You know, bustle, bustle. I love the, uh, the bat, the, uh, the, uh, the battle, the background music that plays in this. That was earlier, wasn't it? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I love that. It's, like, so high on, like, tension. So walking around and saying, oh, hey, what's up? You see that chest? And it takes you so damn long to be able to actually get it, and it's, like, not even worth it for... There's Alan just to being a total poser. Ha-ha! <laughs> get it, poser! Ha-ha! Ha-ha! Oh, Ray, bad pun. <laughs> I, like... Uh, <laughs> like, what? Why wow. are you mad at me? She only came to apologize, and then she just bitched Alan out for the vermin standing like that. The trap. Prepare yourself. Michael McConaughey! <laughs> And Christopher <laughs> Freeman, number two. So we'll finally hear it. The song. Oh, I can't dude. Wait for that wonderful song. <laughs> uh, Albedo. Uh, what are, are, what kind of kinky shit are you into, dude? Yes, let's hope that wasn't furthering thoughts of necrophilia at all. <laughs> Meanwhile, thousands of miles away. Hey. Mm, let's go, let's go check YouTube. <laughs> hey. You hear that? What's that ominous sounding song? And we're st steadfast eh, steadfastly approaching my least favorite part of this game. It can't be. Definitely. The song of, Nephilim? The song of what now? Huh? Oh, chaos. Where have I heard chaos. that before? That song, they mustn't allow <laughs> it to play. Dude. What the? <laughs> see Wilhelm and uh, Scarlet Robe over here just playing so chess. Scarlet Beak, I would call him. So <laughs> Scarlet Beak. So you oh, began. Damn. Whoa! Whoa! Were they just near the Kukai Foundation? Like. Oh, yeah. dude! Talk That's collateral that. damage! Seriously? You know, this reminds me of oh. Starship Troopers, the movie. <laughs> what the hell's going on? Large scale gate out. Repeat. Large oh, scale gate shit. out. The UN oh, no. domestic structure is being forcibly replaced. And epic music to go along with it. Aw, <laughs> oh, this is the little play all over again. I don't like this. Oh, dude. Did you have to see, well, see these guys let's again? Let's just hope that Durandal is the as ownsome as it was back then. <laughs> Four minutes to contact with the Foundation. The civilians. Yeah, fails, you'd want to do that. To abandon the foundation. Is that acceptable? I'll leave it to you. Evacuate all civilians into the Durandal! You tell him, Junior. I'll make the announcement. Red alert! Red alert! Battle stations! Everyone, GTFO! Get the hell out of here unless you want to be crystallized and turned into salt! Where's Cosmos? If we activate the Hilbert effect, it could buy us some time for the evacuation. Why just Cosmos? She Momo has one too! I know, right? That, wow, look at that. What, Are you ready? what timing? Yes, I am ready. Whoa, damn! That's fast acting. Tough acting can act it. Reports of massive <laughs> sighting from <laughs> Colony Precinct 32! They've Thanks for telling us, 100 Series. 18 and 27. What? The Hilbert effect. Do it now! Today. I am fully charged! This should keep them from materializing inside the colony. In any case, we have to hurry up and get everyone on board. If we don't do something, the Gnosis are going to Is take over the entire metropolis. Is this a silly little again? I'll go for the evacuation. I'll go as well. So, 
Basically, we're all already kick ass. Flashback! Ish. Considering Ish. it's like a future flashback. I so guess. Flashback, I guess? <laughs> I mean, it is tainted Sepia, so it probably is a flashback. It's a flashback to a possible future, so. Back to the future! We're counting on you. I am happy to be of service. Where we're going, Good. we don't need roads. Aw, <laughs> <laughs> oh, damn. We need a ship to go from the Durandal to the Kukai Foundation. <laughs> so yeah, long story short, Gnosis are attacking the Kukai Foundation. Get your ass over there, you got Gnosis to kill. That's kind of a stupid question. Go to the lower level, yes or no. <laughs> it's like I stood on the pad for a reason. Go to the lower level? <laughs> oh, it was like that. I, I hate, they, they did that back on the Woglin Day, too, when you went to use the elevator to the bridge. <laughs> Go to the bridge? Yeah, why did I think you, why did I think I wanted like, to come inside the They summoned me to the bridge. Why else would I be going here? <laughs> so here I decided to, uh, Go to the menu and equip Cosmos with um, various doodads and make everyone learn skills. So, because skills are very important and raising your skill level is like, well, not required since I actually didn't know about skills until like late, like, like very, very, very late in my first playthrough. Well, it doesn't help that 99% of the skills they give you up until about the last 10% of the game are useless, pretty much. And the ones that are good are, like, level 5 requirements, and you get them at, like, the end of the game. Pretty much. So if you don't level your skills up, you can't use them. <laughs> I mean, you can equip the accessory, but... <laughs> yeah, what's... What, Only yeah, one person what good in that? <laughs> Only one person gets the, gets the skill. You want to give it to everyone, don't you? Be a real I mean, fighter! What you gonna do, brother? It takes so much to level up. Like, even to, like, level 3 and level 4. I, I think... I don't even think I made it to level 5 by the end of my playthrough. Like, you'd have to do some serious... Uh... You have to do some serious, uh... Check that play. shit out! I, I, I am like blanking rail on the cannon. Part. You have to do some serious, uh, grinding, so... Serious grinding for skill points, so I just quit X Buster here. Again, totally not popping out, uh, Mega Man X. Seriously. Don't see what's Capcom. So I cut out here, just going out to the Kukai Foundation to save you guys some time. Yeah. So, let's kill things. Yes? Please? That's always a good thing. We're out of here! Hmm. Now we come back! Now we see that everyone is freaking lined up just to, just to totally evac right now. You, you'd think they need a, uh, a ticket number dispenser and a big sign saying, Now serving, you know, number 55. <laughs> now serving number 55. That's me! Let me get the hell out of here! So where you want to go is City 6 or 60, 26 and 27. That's where you the main part of this whole fiasco is going down. And we have Life or Death playing! You know what that means. Chaos. Not the character. Absolute chaos. <laughs> this guy's like, oh hey, save the people, and if you want to buy anything, I'll, I'll sell it to you. Yeah, now see, this is a problem I've had in pretty much every RPG ever. You're out there saving your busting your ass to save the world, or even just a colony, and people still want to charge you money. Pretty much. It's like, come on. Look, dude, dude if I die, idea. you're dead too, so you don't get any other money. So, yeah. you think the yeah. incentive would be, oh, I want to make even more money, so I'm going to give these guys free stuff, and say, hey, I gave this guy, I gave our heroes free stuff, you come buy my stuff. <laughs> <laughs> so, I ran to, I ran to a, a, a battle full of kobolds, god damn it, kobolds. So I, I, like, I didn't want to wait, I didn't want to waste any time, so I was like, fuck this, throwing blade. And one of the one of the one of the holes is Dick Move right here. Did you see that? Actually, 
Actually, I did. <laughs> One of them dodged the thorny blade. I wasn't actually aware that they could dodge that. So. I wasn't aware that any anyone even were able to dodge ether abilities. It's How you know dare you? Sayonara, Later, baby. once we get the OMG super secret spoiler <laughs> later on, you need to like encephalon an area that has a kobold and just destroy them with it <laughs> as payback for this. So that's one of the fish we need to rescue. He's just like totally posing out of the thing. Oh, hey, those won't find me, even though I totally stand out. Yeah, this is about the biggest fetch quest ever at this point. Pretty much. Alright, 12 people to go, and we'll see you later. Bye.